Hello Aquarius, welcome to my channel, Triple Two Jarrow, and today I'm doing weekly general love reading from September 1 to 7, 2019. This is for Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, in love. Let's see what's happening for you in this week, okay? You can come to me for personal reading if you want to, details are given on my channel. But this is a general love reading, take what resonates with you. It will not apply for everyone. But if it does, then all the better. Thank you so much, guys. We are already in 50k sub subscriber. Uh, we are expanding day by day. And thank you so much, whoever is supporting my channel, my work. I really appreciate each one of you. Thank you so much. Again, you can come to me for personal reading if you want to. Details are given on my channel. You can come to me for... You can join me on Instagram and Facebook. I will truly appreciate it, guys. Thank you so much for your love support, okay? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus in Aquarius. What's happening for you this week? What is coming for you? I will just pick up your energy first. That what's happening. Main, obviously your focus energy. And then the person you're dealing with, he or she, how they're feeling and what's their action towards you with the tarot. Energy could be vice versa if you're a cross watcher or if you are Aquarius. I will just pick up the energy between two people, okay? Okay, what's happening here? From Angel's answers, you have to take action. So I feel like Aquarius, you're moving forward. As you can see that, I'm, I'm seeing the star. Look at this. It's like unicorn and star and spirituality, divinations, believing on divinations, okay, connecting with the God, spirituality. I don't know. Take a, Taking action. You're moving forward. Nobody can stop you. That's how you're seeing, uh, to, saying to this person. Saying to everyone, like, nobody can stop you now. You're ready to move forward. You're ready to fly. You're ready to take action. Or you already took the action and you're moving forward in your life. Yeah, separation. From the Romance Angels cards, you have separation. Time apart from your partner is on the horizon. So I feel for some of Aquarius, you are done with the past. You're making uh, a move. You are separating yourself from this partner, taking a break from this person for some of you. And if not, take, then this is a separation going on between you and this person. And taking action. You're moving forward. You're saying to this person, that like, I'm done. Okay, I, ha I can't wait for you. I have to move on. It's time to move on. Then you have this card from release. That is the death card here. Could be dealing with Scorpio. Look at this. It's a big challenge for you. Something happening for you. This could be a major breakup for some of you. This could be a major breakup uh, or separation for you. You are separating yourself from something, from that energy, that situation that is not serving you. This is also a big challenge for you to separate from this person, but you are already doing it. The death card also talk about overcoming through all the challenges and moving forward. You are taking action. You are moving forward. Seven of Wands, choose your battle. This is your battle and you are moving forward. Seven of Wands could be dealing with Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. This is you, okay, blocking this person uh, and you are, could be, this is you. You are standing on your ground. You are saying to all the persons, to this person, everyone, like, no. Nobody can come to me and nobody can talk to shit to me. Nobody can hear, come to me and say to me like, I'm here, I'm there. No, I want action. I want movements. I don't want to believe on the words. That's how you're saying to this person and situation. It's like you're done. Okay, that's all. Aquarius, you are into power. There's no offense, but you are into power. Like taking action. You don't care anymore because you're choosing yourself and that's good that's better that's better let's uh let's find out how this person is behaving feeling and their challenge for this week okay how they're feeling energy could be vice versa okay don't forget that but this is separation like you guys are not talking there's no communication at all the death mean here that you are it's, you're saying to this person, this relationship is dead for me. It's over. It's done. And you're taking action. You're moving. You're about to take action. You already took the action. Okay? So it's happening here because there's no communication. There is no movement. Seven of Wands. Someone blocked you. You blocked them. If you don't block them, then it looks like you're blocking them. Like, no. You're saying to everyone, no, I'm not into mood of dating. I'm not mood of into someone come towards me. Let's see what this person is behaving in this way. Okay. Ten of Pentacles, bottom of the deck. Yeah, there is a commitment issue. There could be a family issues. For some of you, there is a breakup going on. Like, 
if you are married with this person there is some separation that you are could be you are married with this person and you're getting divorced ten of pentacles because you you feel like this is a solid relationship but something happening separation from your partner because the bottom of the deck again nine of pentacles it's like you're being single you're done are you wanting to a committed relationship with someone you feel like ten of pentacles you feel like there is a solid foundation but it was not ten of nine of pentacles ten to nine like you are you're definitely free now you're being single or someone is getting single here like this is a separation this is a this is over this is done that's how you're saying ten of pentacles also talk about like uh, you know working on just focus on your business your career and you are definitely more into your career and you want to settle down you want to um, could be you want to buy a home that's why you're working very hard for money it's like you're not you're not ready for a relationship right now you're not ready for love right now you're done you're over your focus is ten of pentacles money 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 i want money that's how you're saying are this person focused on more money uh, there could be family issues between you and this person that's why you guys got separated this person is could be already married that's why for some of you there is a problem someone has children involved yeah for some of you children involved here okay what this person is doing seven of pentacles for you and for this connection in this connection could be dealing with taurus Virgo, capricorn they're waiting for you they're still there they're waiting for the right time to come towards you are they waiting for the right time to make the move they're also waiting for you to come toward them i don't know but this is this is like wait seven of pentacles it's like they're not into hurry how they're feeling towards you page of pentacles could be younger than you this person is they want to they, they're sorry that what happened is they're sorry and they're generally sorry i don't know but i feel this person really is sorry and they want forgiveness they want another chance page of pentacles and they want to make a off effort but they want to offer you something but they feel like they can't could be you are waiting for this offer like 10 of pentacles but they can offer you only this like they're feeding you like just you know like teeny tiny things like I can be with you, I can go out with you, but you are saying, no, I want something serious. If you're not into that, then we are done. But this person can only offer you this right now. Or even they are not offering it because with the seven of pentacles, they are still waiting for this offer to offer you. This could be forgiveness, this could be second chance. What is a challenge, page of cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, they need to speak up. They need to express their feelings, but they're not doing it. You have two pages here. It could be children involved. The definitely is into younger energy. You have two pages. You are asking them to something, you know, step up. And this person is like, no, I have to wait. What action they are taking towards you in this week, Seven of Wands, it looks like you both are not talking with each other. You both. You both are stubborn, could be. You're Leo Sagittarius. You blocking them, they blocking you. Nobody's talking action. Nobody's taking move here. Nobody is ready to talk. That's how I'm getting here. But you are done, Aquarius. Vice versa. Page of Cups also talk about someone new is here. You are looking for someone new. Or you are talking with someone new. It's also talk about going out with someone. Like it's a date. You know, you're going out. And you're spending a time with someone like you know casually could be someone new that you're falling in or they are falling in love with you but the person you're dealing with already it's done it's over because i feel like they're still waiting on for something to offer you like but it's done it could be this person is waiting for you to offer them if you did something wrong then they're saying that you you, you need to come and say sorry someone is definitely waiting for the sorry like apologize Apology, like come towards me and say sorry what you did to me. Otherwise, I will not accept you. Like offer me something serious also. Because I'm looking for this nice ten of pentacles and you are offering me this. Like casually, friendship or just going out. No, I'm not for that. Whoever this person here is, their energy is very strong. 
Ten of Pentacles also could be uh, talk about family issues, money issues. There's a separation going on. You're done. Someone is done here. They're saying with the death card here, it's over. It's done. I can't. I can't do it anymore. It's over. So you're taking action. You're moving forward. This, action, this card is for you, Aquarius. Nobody can stop you now. This is you. You're moving forward. Whatever is happening. And you're looking for future now. Now you are saying, no, I have no time for past. I have no time for anything to put my energy that is wasting. Okay? So more focus on work, more focus on your energy, your family. Could be you're spending your time with your family, friends. It's okay. You're not ready for love. So I really hope it resonated with you guys. Let me know in the comments. I will truly appreciate it. Thank you so much.